In this video, we will try to solve another question that was asked in JNU MA Economics 2021 paper. The question is like this. When Cobb-Dow's production function is given as Q is equal to A into L to the power 0.5, K to the power 0.5, what will be the total production when uh, total factor productivity is 8, labor is equal to 25, and capital is equal to 64? The options are 320, 420, uh, 623, or 320, okay? So we have a typical Cobb Douglas production function. This Q, let us write it here. Uh, this Q denotes the total output. A is the total factor productivity or the state of technology. And it shows uh, the change in the output, which is not explained uh, by labor or capital. Okay. And this L is the labor, K is the capital. Uh, this 0 0.5 is alpha, what we call the output elasticity of labor. And uh, this uh, 0 0.5 which is beta here it is called the output elasticity of capital okay and our production function is uh, like this okay so uh, we need to find the total production so simply we have q is equal to our a in place of a this is also called the total factor productivity uh, what we call the solo uh, residual and its value is 8 so i will write here 8 so first let me write this we have a this can be written as under root uh, L and we have under root K this is our production function okay so let's uh, give the value so our TFP that is total product uh, factor productivity is 8 so I will write here 8 under root of uh, L L is being given as 25 and K K is being given as 64 okay if we solve this will come out to be 8 uh, under root 25 you can be written as 5 square okay and this uh, under root 64 we can write it 8 square square and root gets cancelled we are left with 8 into 5 into 8 this is uh, 8 5s are 30 sorry 8 5s are 40 let me rub this out here 8 5s are 40 into 8 so this is 8 0 are 0 uh, 8 4 is or that is 320 okay so the correct option uh, i guess should be this d part that is 320 i hope i make myself clear in this video i have actually made uh, the videos on cop dollars production functions in detail and i have shown there what is meant by output elasticity of demand uh, output elasticity of um, capital and labor uh, total factor productivity or how we calculate the growth rate when we are being given the values of labor capital and output okay so for that you can just subscribe this channel and i i also expect from you people please share subscribe comment this uh, comment and like this channel that's only incentive for me to keep going on i am just trying to uh, solve as many numericals on mathematical economics as i can so i need your support if you can support this channel that uh, is the only thing that i can move forward thank you you can also uh, uh, share this channel with your economics friends that will make this channel more efficient okay thank you